Project Runway fans, we're back here on After the Runway. This week was the Garnier Element Challenge, and I don't know, that was a bit weird, a bit of a stretch. <laughs> yeah, there are natural elements in Garnier, yeah. therefore earth, in, earth wind, <laughs> fire, fire, air, makes sense, but... Yeah. Yeah. Either way, the designers had to each pick an element, and I thought that was really cool. I was pretty excited to see what they were going to do, because it was like, go, use your imaginations, and yes. they really did, I thought. Some of the things were a bit of a stretch. <laughs> <laughs> right away, as soon as Amy mentioned that she was going to fill a bowl with hair, I remembered your cat in yes. a sling. Like, that has to be the cat in a sling. <laughs> that was a bizarre concept. I don't... I don't understand where I she don't got that from. It I'm like, oh my god, hairy boobs. <laughs> yeah, I really loved Seth Aaron's look. Like, I loved it. Loved it. I loved it when he started putting it together. I loved the whole air, midnight, stars, sky approach, and the swoopy. I just loved it. I love his look. And uh, when he first started talking about it, I was like, mm, this is a huge stretch, and it's just so that you can do what you usually do. Yeah. But he did it well, so mm -hmm. you know it worked out. Yeah, totally. It was just beautifully constructed, and I love the detailing on the back, mm -hmm. like how it like draped at the back mm -hmm. and with those pieces, just yeah. amazing. I also really enjoyed Mini Maya or Mini Mila or whatever we can call her. <laughs> what did you say, um, Christina, Christina Ricci? Ricci. <laughs> I just love the sleeves, the like movement, and I know. Oh, it was beautiful. And they went and said it was all Nina Ricci. And what else ah. could you say but say no? It came from my brain. Mm -hmm. like I didn't I thought that was weird because we haven't really heard them criticize her in that way before, saying that she's too derivative. I thought, mm. oh, where's that coming from? There's no such thing as originality, mm -hmm. you know? So everything just gets repeated, yeah. as mm -hmm. we all know in fashion. So. Yeah. Yeah, it's just interesting how they kind of had their hate on for her this week. Yeah, like they loved it. Like, what did Nina say? It's a perfectly beautiful dress. Mm -hmm. But it's like, oh, okay, yeah. what are you saying here? <laughs> Nina was a Debbie Downer this week. She was. <laughs> she totally she said, was. was like, uh, yeah. Oh, Mila, she got taken down a peg this week. Oh. Thank God. I thought she was going to be tops when they called her. I, I didn't really dig her outfit, but I thought it was really well tailored. That's what I thought. So I too. thought, oh, okay, they must they must like it. But then they just ripped into her, and I was I like, know. yes. <laughs> it was boring. Yeah. Very boring. Yeah, I actually got really excited when they showed her in the workroom, and she was talking about, you know, Blade Runner, and mm -hmm. Blade Runner was her inspiration. So I was expecting like this really sharp, minimal, you yep. know, futuristic tailored outfit. It was disappointing. <laughs> yeah, I love how Heidi called it like wear like clothes for a mall walk. <laughs> like we're old people. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's awesome. I love when Heidi gets a zinger in there. <laughs> Jonathan, this week, when he was saying that he was going to secretly win the challenge, I was like kind of feeling him. I was like, yeah, you know, you kind of under the radar and you've got skills. And then when his dress came out, I really loved it right away. The mm -hmm. high sort of collar around her face and the creating the textile and the laughter thing, I thought was a little bit um, hippy dippy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but the garment was beautiful. Yeah, Jonathan's was just. Amazing and mm -hmm. just gorgeous and the detailings and the constructions and you can just really really see him in the piece Like yeah. it was mm -hmm. so his aesthetic and his style. And yeah, it was a good job good It looked job like done. a tour like it. Yeah, it was yeah. beautiful And I feel like his model with her cute accent I know. Like one so cute. Cute. <laughs> And yeah. like taking the color from her skin tone I love and like that. pale nose pale. Yeah, that was just that. cute. They had so a nice cute. little thing going on <laughs> yeah. Poor Ben this week. I, I've enjoyed Ben and I've wanted him to really rise to the front, but why Why would you do a suit first time ever when you're like the eighth designer on Project Runway? Like, bad timing to try something new, gosh. Yes, I know. And I kind of, as much as they thought it was corny, I kind of liked the shark thing. Me too. In a suit shape. It just, it didn't work. The no. concept was there, but the execution wasn't. Oh, no. it was so poorly it made. It was poorly made and uh, I really feel like it was just something that we've seen before as well, too. Like, mm -hmm. it wasn't interesting. Well, that's episode eight, The Elements of Fashion, sponsored by Garnier. <laughs> mm -hmm. Maybe we'll get some Garnier products by saying that. I use uh, Curls and Shine myself, Garnier, so email me. And uh, hopefully we'll see you all back here next week for After the Runway.